guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. I am back after quite some time with a very different kind of video than I normally do on this channel. If you have been following my channel, you might have noticed I've been posting a few travel videos here and there because I've been traveling quite a lot this year. And so I asked you guys on Instagram if you would like to see a shopping haul from my trip there and a lot of you guys said yes. So here it is this is something very different from what i normally do so please let me know in the comments if you enjoy this video and if you would like me to do more of these i'm gonna show you some of the clothing items that i got some art supplies as well and a lot of mixed items from accessories to skincare to makeup and stuff like that so let's just get started most of the things that i got are from bangkok because we had like three days at the end of our trip and all of the three days were spent shopping all day we went to platinum mall central world cm paragon so i'm the kind of person that likes to wear basics and basically clothes that i feel comfortable in so most of the stuff that i got are from h&m and uniqlo i'm gonna be honest because platinum mall had a lot of cheap clothes that were really trendy but i felt like i'm i was only gonna wear those kind of clothes once and then they were just not that good quality so i just went straight to h&m so let's start with this sweatshirt i got this navy blue sweatshirt it's slightly oversized but it's really comfortable it also has this fleece lining inside this was in the h&m sale section and it was only 3.99 baht for the quality the price was amazing and i've already worn this so many times after i got back this is the second sweatshirt that i got it's just this um, maroon brown color and again it's kind of like an oversized fit and it says colorado in this orange it's kind of the soft material and then again it has the fleece lining which makes it super comfortable and i just love oversized sweatshirts for the fall and winter time and i know i will be living in this sweatshirt because i like it so much i'm kind of obsessed with this kind of color right now so speaking of that color i got a jacket in the same color this is just a simple corduroy jacket again it has a slightly oversized fit and it has buttons there's no inner lining but it still feels kind of warm there's pockets and there's pockets inside as well which i love and this is from uniqlo the next thing that i got is this top and i live in tank tops like this in the summer so i got it in this baby blue color and i also got this in black but i will insert the try on clip somewhere the next thing that i got are these joggers and these are from h&m the, these were in the sale section as well and this was only 5.99 baht it's just this really nice baby blue color it's high waisted and the thing that sold me on it is this embroidery of bambi on it it's just so cute it's in the front and it's just so comfortable this one is lined with fleece as well and i just love the color and the embroidery on it i forgot that i also got this sweater that i'm wearing right now it's this really nice brown color i've really been loving the browns for this season and it's this really soft like knit material and it's kind of like slouchy feeling the sleeves are slightly like hanging like this but it feels so comfortable the last few clothing pieces are basics from uniqlo first two things are the same things in two different colors so this is the ultra stretch high rise cropped legging pants and they're just these stretchy legging pants and i got them in this navy blue and this black color it's just something basic that you always need in your closet and i tried these on in the shop and they were so comfortable which is why i got two of them the last clothing item i got is from uniqlo and this is the heat tech technology wear if you live where it gets really cold this is going to be a lifesaver it's uh what you wear underneath it's like the base layer that you wear in the winter i got this in this brownish color and it also has a high neck i also got it in black with a normal neckline 
that looks like this. I also got the bottoms to that so that I will be set for the winter. I think those were the last clothing items that I got. So let's move on to art supplies because I just got a few art supplies. There was like a whole art section in CM Paragon Mall. So I got two sketchbooks. As you guys know, I love my art journals and I have the normal like A5 size. And I saw these and they were very similar to my art journal, but they're like different shapes. They're a lot smaller and this one's a different size as well but yeah these two i got it in a baby pink and a baby blue color and i love the colors and then i got some brush sign pen i think this is from pentel yeah so i got five colors i got black one an ice blue one a baby pink one a brown sort of tan color and then a baby blue color Okay, so let's move on to our last category. It's all mixed together now. So I'm gonna start with this one. This is from the Asiatic Riverfront. We went to see the Lantern Festival here. It's called the Loi Krathong um, Lantern Festival. And it's where you like light up the, these decorated pieces with a candle on top, and then you let them go in the riverfront that place was just amazing i'm gonna put up some clips here but the food the street food was amazing there was a fireworks show at the end and there were a lot of souvenir shops and local shops that we went to and i got these they had these like i'm gonna insert a clip here i thought these were fruit at first because they smelled like fruit and they looked like fruit so this is the one i got it's this um mango one and it smells amazing mango is my favorite fruit and it smells exactly like a freshly cut mango they had so many of these in different fruits and every single thing smelled exactly what it looked like the next thing i got is this honey one and it has this honeycomb with two little bees on it and it smells exactly like honey now let's move on to this bag so i got an iphone case and i got this from platinum mall they had so many different varieties but i really like a simple one for my phone so i got a black one and i got this pastel purple one which i have on my phone the next thing i got is this eyeshadow palette this is from Sivana colors and it is in number one grapefruit all of the colors are really pretty it's got some really nice neutral shades and some really glittery shades as well but i love all of the colors so i got this let's just continue with makeup so i got this bb perfect powder you have these BB powders from so many different brands, but I saw this one and I got it just to try it out. I've never tried like BB powders before. And then I also got the same thing in Pons because I forgot I bought that one already. So I got the Pons one and this one is the Blurring Filler Translucent Powder. So I went to the Innisfree shop and I was talking to the person there because I wanted their cushion foundation Thing. I don't know if that's correct, but they didn't have it in my shade. They were all very light on my skin. So I went for the pore blur powder instead. It comes in this box thing and then you open it and you have this applicator thing and you can see the powder coming out but it's kind of a white powder but it's translucent when you apply it on your skin and it makes it look really flawless and the lady there was really nice so when i got this she gave me this free brightening pore uh, sleeping mask at the end when i was leaving I also got this Maybelline Fit Me 24 hour oil control powder foundation. It looks like this and it has a little applicator which is a little dirty. I want to peel this off on camera for you guys. Wow. <laughs> so the next thing that I got is this Bior sunscreen. It's supposed to be a really good sunscreen. It's 
water resistant and it has a very high level UVB, UVA protection watery hydrate essence next thing is this eye roller thing it's just simple aloe vera and fresh collagen eye roller serum so the next things i got on the airport duty free and they are these these are from soap and glory and this is the glad hair day this is the frizz free heat protection and this is the smoothing serum my hair is not naturally straight i always straighten it it's actually really frizzy and curly so i thought that these would be great for styling the next thing is this cetaphil gentle skin cleanser i've heard a lot of good things about it but i haven't tried it myself before so i got a small one so that i can try it out and if it works great with my skin i will get a bigger version of this and the last few items are from cerave this is the hydrating cream to foam cleanser the first time i tried this was in my europe trip i was in madrid and my skin was horrible at that time it was breaking out every day so i went to the pharmacy there and i got this because it said that it cleanses hydrates and removes makeup that was the thing that caught my eye so i got this there and instantly the next day all of the breakouts had calmed down it made my skin feel so much better which is why i always keep repurchasing this because it works great with my skin and it removes makeup at the same time so i use it in the evenings to go with that i also got the facial moisturizing lotion this is for the am it has spf 25 and it moisturizes throughout the day and helps restore the protective skin barrier with three essential ceramides niacinamide and hyaluric acid hyaluronic acid okay so that's all for my skincare makeup and stuff so the last few things are some accessories so this is a woven bag that i got from the krabby night market walking street area and the thing that caught my eye was this sunflower the sunflower is made of this felt type material and the rest of the bag is made of this woven material it's just this very simple bag and i kind of tied it at the top because it was too long because i'm a little short and it just has this uh, zipper that opens up and it just has this one compartment i use this while going to the beach and just roaming around then from around the same area like the crabby night walking street i also got these slippers these are just plain white slip-on sandal slippers they're a little dirty because i wore it throughout the whole trip because they were so comfortable and easy to just slide on and the white just went with all of my outfits they're really good quality as well i did not expect them to be such good quality for the price i think it was only 250 baht or 200 baht i don't know last and final thing that i got is this thing right over here i did all the shopping and then i realized that they are not going to fit in my suitcase because i had only taken a small cabin bag kind of suitcase and i knew that all of this was not gonna fit in there so um on the last day there was the pratinam night market and i saw this suitcase there and it's this really nice pastel color and it has like it's actually good quality and it has a lock here as well i'm gonna let you guys guess how much this suitcase cost um, it's actually it has the four wheels it has the handle it has this and i'm actually really happy with this purchase so that ends this whole shopping haul please let me know in the comments if you would like to see more of these videos and that's it for this one don't forget to leave a like on the video if you enjoyed it and make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i hope i'll see you in the next one Bye!